Hello everybody, it's Felix from the Tennis Brothers here and this is my bag check. So before we start, thank you to Tennis Point for giving me this bag. There'll be a link in the description where you can check it out. It's the Federer DNA 12 racket bag. And so let's see what's inside. So I've packed my bag as if I have a tournament. So it's my tournament bag. I have a tournament, which is a national tournament this Wednesday. Um, I'm really excited. So I've packed my bag early and I'm going to show you guys what's inside. So let's start with the side compartment. I usually put small things in here because there's not a lot of space. Hopefully you do that as well. So I've got some grips uh, right here just in back in case I run out, which is always very important, especially if the weather's bad, if it's raining, if it's hailing or even, then your grips get really sweaty and slippery, so you're gonna need more than one. I've got my skipping rope and my resistance band, uh, which make for a really good warm up as part of my fitness training with Daz. So he's given me a warm up and I use these to get myself ready and warm. So now onto the rackets compartment. I've got four rackets in here at the moment, but this bag can hold 12. I have the Wilson 98 with countervail and I also have my Biddy Baddy dampeners on these rackets because they are my favorite. It also has thermal cooling technology so your rackets stay cool, especially in hot weather, and so your strings don't turn into a trampoline. So now the last compartment is where I keep most of my gear. First of all, I've got my foam roller, which actually also can, can hold um, some of your valuables, if you're, especially if you're traveling. It's very hard and it protects them. So in this case, I've got my phone in here. Don't usually carry my phone in this, but for the purposes of this video, I'm just gonna show you guys. And it's hollow on the inside, uh, which is also very useful. Um, if you don't want it to get broken. Just leave that there. So we've also obviously got my tennis shoes. I have a pair of clay court and a pair of hard court that I normally take with me. I also take the second bag, but these are the shoes that I'm wearing at the moment. I really like them. Um, so yeah. Also got my wristbands, uh, matching the colour of my outfit. As you can see, French Open Biddy Badu collection. Um, so I like to wear these when I play. I have two because I only use them on my right arm, but you know, you'll sometimes sweat and have played more than one match. So I've also got my medical kit in case the club doesn't have any medical supplies. I've got loads of different things in here, plasters, I've got some eye spray, which is really good. Um, especially when you get an injury on court, you can just put that on and it won't hurt anymore. It's very hard to close though. There you go. And second last, we've got my deodorant, which I use after I've showered after matches. And I've also got a towel when I'm playing, just to wipe off sweat, I suppose. And it's also got the same cooling technology, so if you want to put more rackets in here, um, you can. Let's close these two up. I've also got the final compartment, just like the one here, which you can put um, something. I've got my headphones in here at the moment. And there's also straps within these to put loose things in so that they don't get, um, especially if your bag's full. It's also good to sort different things out. So I also have my water here. I know it's very big, but I don't like filling my water up all of the time. And it's useful when I have a really long match on court. Last but not least, there are many different ways to hold my bag. Hold it here, hold it here. And you've got the straps which are adjustable to put it on as well. Like this. If you want to see the video of why I changed my rackets, you can go click on the link up there to go watch it. I'd definitely recommend that. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe and turn bell notifications on to not miss another video. And I'll see you in the next one.